Progress is being made in St. Charles County tonight as a $100 million investment in wine country is taking shape. Six vineyards and four wineries have been purchased as part of this project, and it aims to transform Augusta wine country into the Napa Valley of the Midwest. News 4's Caroline Hecker gives you a look at the changes that are in store. A cedar fence will soon encompass the new and improved Balducci Vineyards and Winery along Highway 94 in Augusta. It's a big project in itself, spanning hundreds of yards in both directions, mimicking the scope of the $100 million project taking place. Everything that you know about Balducci is going to stay Balducci. It is that enhancement of the aesthetics of the property bringing everything back up to where it needs to be. That includes a fresh coat of sailor orange paint around the property designed to catch the eye, even from above. The current patio and restaurant will remain with plans for an amphitheater featuring live music. The former Balducci home on the property is also getting some TLC, offering accents of that sailor orange. We are starting interior demo work, just ripping out carpets, um, kitchen fixtures, and our plan is to make it into a five-star restaurant. It will be a dining destination in St. Charles County for sure. Beyond the property, several buildings in Augusta have a fresh coat of paint and will soon offer back road tours and carriage rides complete with Clydesdales. Trolleys offer winery goers a safe way to navigate the rolling hills. So if you wanted to do a quick winery trip, stop at each of them. You can park your car and not have to worry about getting back in and driving to each of the wineries. With the restoration of the wineries set to be complete this fall, work on a hotel and golf course could begin next year. In Augusta, Caroline Hecker, News 4.